shots and fired at me. And I don't think so far. Over here, guys! Watch out, he's shooting. Take cover on the building! Are you over there by the orbit room? Affirmative. Shots fired. New dash cam and body cam video revealing the intense moments an FBI agent opened fire on Grand Rapids police and the bizarre interview that took place after it was all over. We got the video through the Freedom of Information Act, and Susan Samples is here to break down what the video shows us. Susan? Brian, police turned over nearly two dozen video clips to us from the dash cams and body cams of several Grand Rapids police officers. We get to see the first interview also with Las Vegas FBI Special Agent Ruben Hernandez moments after he allegedly fired his gun at police. But first, we want to show you what led up to his arrest. This all happened just after one in the morning at, at the Planet Fitness Gym near Centerpoint Mall. Within minutes of getting the call of a man with a gun, a small army of officers shows up. In this clip, you can see a team of officers in tactical gear, helmets and shields, slowly approach Ruben, who is already on the ground. His gun already in the parking lot in the interview you can hear Hernandez is clearly confused anybody that's wearing this uniform I will not hurt you ma'am okay. you know okay, here's the thing okay you have a holster on you there's a gun in the parking lot stop talking there's a gun in the parking lot from the direction that you came you took a shot at one of our officers you're not going anywhere you're going to stay in the car until someone can come and talk to you. Do you understand that? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Ma'am, ma'am, can you take it off from me? No. I will not. No. I will. Then about 15 minutes later, a little clarity sets in. Who knows? My career is probably over. Hernandez is now facing assault charges in Kent County. His attorney tells us he had some kind of paranoid episode and that alcohol was involved. We don't know much about why Hernandez was here from his home FBI post in Las Vegas, only that he was investigating a fraud case. Hernandez bonded out of jail and was allowed to leave the state, but he is expected back for a court appearance in a couple weeks. Live in studio control, Susan Samples, 24-Hour News 8.